from the media panel comes from the Williams of the Mary County. Um, I'd like to follow up Bruce's question a little bit. Um, in the past 10 years, we've had many large companies leave the county. Do you think that these incentives that you talked about would be better served to smaller companies and small businesses, which is the way that the future is going as far as employment? You can stay in all of Sure, there are things that local government can do. I've had an experience on the on the uh, City Council. Uh, but again, we don't have that back in. There are global economics, national economics, and state economics to play. And the, the global and national economics that concern me the most are these crazy uh, international trade agreements we've gotten ourselves involved in, which caused Ross Perot's giant sucking sound to occur as jobs left this country and went to other places for cheap, sometimes slave labor. And so I think we've got to turn that around in order to improve the business climate in Illinois also. But yeah, there are local things that can be done. We've done them in Salem. I know the mayor's been in the have worked on that. And it's in China, I've worked on that. And I think there's even a greater role for counties to induce businesses to come to our county. Thank you very much, Dan Stone. The, uh, the uh, tax and increment financing uh, districts, the um, enterprise zones, those are all kinds of local incentives that, that are good. You know, as long as the local tax incentives agree to give that, that, those, that revenue away, as long as that's open to the public as to what they're going to give up for new businesses, that's fine. But you know, the best thing you can do is to give the tax incentives. You know, the CME uh, Sears bill that passed, which gave millions of dollars back to those companies. Why? Because they had lobbyists that complained about the tax increase. You know, the problem with that, and the reason I voted against it, is because we got nothing. Small businesses got nothing. We still got the 67% increase. But because CME and Sears had big time lobbyists, they got their way. That's not fair. Everyone should get break in the state. Every small business should get, get their money back from the tax increase. Thank you, Tom Parker.